Hello everyone, it's Wilson here. Today, let's continue to talk about finding the domain of functions. This is maybe the fifth or the sixth video that I have created to find a domain of functions. And my goal is to actually cover um, finding domain for different types of functions. And so we now have a new function here. We have the ln of x minus three. And so the idea for finding domain for the ln function is actually simple. The expression inside the ln function must be greater than zero. So that means it must be positive. Okay, so the idea is that we are going to just write down x minus three is greater than zero. So um, <clears throat> so this function is only defined when x minus three is greater than zero. So it's actually that simple. So we just add three to both sides of the equation, then we are going to get x greater than three. And so basically, that's it, right? Because we already solved for x in this inequality. So we are uh, actually having the domain. If we are to write it in interval notation, it's actually really simple. We just write um, parentheses three and then comma and then infinity. And we are putting parentheses next to three because there is no equal sign here. So that means three is not included. And so as you can see that this ln function, ln of x minus three, is defined for all x values greater than three. Okay, so that's it for this problem. Thank you for watching. I will see you next time.